Um, I did three episode, uh, three issues of the Codex. So there's a graphic novel. I think okay. I have like a dozen left. Yeah, I, did, I got the three issues, yeah. Yeah, so those that's the Codex backstory. Okay. And then I have a one-shot for each of the other characters, which leads up to episode one of season one. Mm -hmm. And let me just tell you, writing comic books is very difficult. And I hated it. I hated it so much until I kind of got the hang of it. And like, I think I would have given up if I hadn't had a deadline to meet and I had already got a contract I signed. I probably would have stopped writing because it was so difficult to transition from a screenplay to a, a comic. But the cool thing is that I persevered because I had to. And then I kind of, just one day I was like, oh yeah, I think I can do this. And I, I, I just, I broke through in a way. And I think that's, you know, a lot of us give up because it's hard and we don't have deadlines. And unless you self-impose your deadlines, um, you know, you have to find somebody else to give you a deadline. So, you know, it's very hard, it takes a lot of discipline, but, you know, just breaking through that was uh, really fun. And then, you know, we did the first collaborations, the first time I ever wrote with somebody, and that was actually really hard too. But then by the third or fourth of those one shots, I was like, oh, this is cool, I have a method, and I learned, you know, page by page how to write with somebody. And Vork is, you know, yeah, this guy, he's uh, such a good writer. It's incredible. <laughs> I think I'm the best in the country. <laughs> Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Uh, hello. Did you find writing comics difficult? Yes. I mean, I write, I, it's very, it is confining, uh, you know, because you have these, uh, you know, panels yeah. that you have to stick with it. And so it was like, I wrote this whole paragraph and you said, oh, that can only be three words. <laughs> exactly. Literally. And then also, you know, trying to follow a story along the edge of a page, you know, like, you have to either have one panel, you know, a page can only have four panels or maybe a certain number, but yeah, the story had to be adjusted for each panel because it's not like a movie. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's, it sounds silly, but it's it's not easy. It's a lot more visual storytelling as well as like brief storytelling. So it was just it's very different. So we I mean, we had fun. I hope you enjoyed it if you read them. Yeah, I mean I'll look back. It's one of the things I'll look back on my life and say I wrote a comic book and I was in one and it's. It's incredible. Like, I, I'm not even. I'm not joking. I can't believe it. I thought, like, so, any more doing story. pre guild flashbacks on the show? Any more? Pre oh, pre guild flashbacks on the show? I'm not sure. You know, um, I've got to figure out what we do after season five, um, and I don't know what that is. <laughs> or should I pretend that I know? Yeah, I know. I just, Hawaii. Yeah.